All right, Yenzers, what's up? So I want to uh, talk about my new crossbreed Super Tuck holster. I uh, got this from Chanderson One. My man got a great channel. He sent me a PM shit probably a month ago when he seen I got my new 45, and he was like, hey, man, I got this holster. I'm not using it no more. Do you want it? And, of course, I was like, yeah, I really appreciate it. Because I've been getting a lot of bullshit from people saying, oh, you're begging for shit, people sending you shit. You know, I don't ask nobody for nothing. People who send me shit, they just send me stuff. And then I always try to send them something back, whether it's, a you know, even a thank you card or um, some paracord shit, whatever the case may be. You know, I'm not asking nobody for nothing. People send me stuff because they have no use for it no more. And they see that I could use it. And use it I do. So, that's all I got to say about that, you know. You don't like it? Sorry. I mean... It's not my fault. But I want to show you. We just seen Pete from the Army Channel. Made a vid on his. And uh, by the way, flyers suck. <laughs> I'm just busting your balls, Pete. Just like you bust mine for the pens. But go pens. Anyways, he showed in his video full length, the 4-inch. And I think he had a 3-inch too. I'm not sure. You can see mine sticks out a little bit like he said. you know. But I'm not worried about that. And what's really nice about this holster for me is, is that it's already broke in some. Because uh, Chanderson 1 was wearing it. It was his carry holster for a while. If you go on his channel, he got like a video about this, a review. And um, he said he wore it for a few months and it's nice and broke in. So I can't wait to uh, check it out. But when I did get it, he mentioned to me that the uh, hardware on it, one of the clips was really bent. See this one right here? And it's nothing. I could have been an eye. You could see they stamped out the cross on this. Well, what I did is I called um, Frostbreed. And I said to them, hey, my hardware's a little jacked up. And they were like, no problem. Today is Friday. I called them Wednesday. So stuff come in the mail today. And as you can see, it's a little different. It's like raised up now. It's not punched out. And the reason they're doing that now is because they said it gives it more rigidity. To where it's not going to see. You can see where it bent. Probably right at that cross right there. Put this on the Mac. See. So it probably got weak right there. Where it was stamped at. So. And now they're just raising it up. But they sent me a whole new setup. For nothing. So again right there. Their customer service is spot on. So now all I got to do is. I got to get a gun belt. Because I got all this shit now. The belt I'm using. I actually don't have it on me. But. It's alright, it's a leather belt, but it's not a gun belt for sure. And I think I'm going to go with the crossbreed gun belt. So, got to save my pennies, nickels, dimes, and we'll get that. So, I'm really happy with this. Again, Chanderson one, can't thank you enough for it. And uh, we're going to put it to use. So, I'm going to try to put it on and uh, show you guys what it looks like when I'm carrying it. Put a shirt on and stuff, because this is a full-size model. So... You know, but it really, I tell you, listen, fits right in there. Nice retention, you know, and it's a heavy gun, man. You know, so, again, I'm really appreciating that. And we're going to show you right now what it looks like when we're riding dirty. Alright, so, I got it on. The only thing I don't like about it is that you need eyes in the back of your head to put the damn thing on. But I guess that'll uh, get easier as I put it on and off. But as you can see, I got a full size 45 on. And I'm sure you can see a little bit. But this shirt isn't really that uh, that loose. I usually wear them a little bigger than this. You know, this is a little tight. But and as you can see, there it is. There's my belt. Again, it's not the best belt, but it's doing the job right there. And you could really feel the uh, holster taking up a lot of the weight of the gun, for sure. So I know if I get a good gun belt, I'm going to be in like Flynn. That's for sure. So again, that's a full-size model. Again... Thanks to my man Chanderson1. I appreciate it. And uh, 
I'll see yins in the next video. Later.